Hey everyone, uh, it's been a little bit, I guess really is a whole lot going on here, you know, uh, just getting ready to be getting geared up, we're just spreading a little bit of manure and things, just nothing too serious just yet, uh, you know, still dealing with our COVID stuff, but actually as a province we're doing really well, we haven't had any new cases for like eight days now, uh, which is good, I think we all, everybody's recovered, we haven't never had any deaths here in the province. Uh, and down to I believe there was seven yesterday that are still recovering so I don't that's that's doing pretty good you know convert compared to a lot of the provinces around us but so I mean we're still dealing with that stuff so we still have to keep social distancing you know but as far as the farming season it's drying out good so pretty soon we'll be starting to hit some fields getting some work done I got a couple new things on the go you know one thing I guess I mentioned another video but we won't get into that just yet till uh, it, it'll be it'll be a, a video coming up, but uh, I got another fellow coming. We're gonna get into we're gonna try growing some squash this year. Uh, of course, I've been selling meat, and uh, I mean, there's no job selling meat right now. Everybody's looking for meat, so you know, there's a good chance people are looking for you know some some vegetables. I used to dabble that a little bit. So we have this other guy. He's really smart. He does. Uh, he's he's a real good connection. He knows how to get rid of it. Right? Anybody can grow it, but if you can't sell it, then it's just a, a pain, right? So. So anyways, you know, we get work at Dam all that stuff. Uh, kids are gone today, so I gotta run up country, go see a guy about, uh, uh, you know, the deal him and I are working on. And uh, go see a few guys, go tag some calves for another fella. And, uh, you know, just get the day in. I guess just a cold, gloomy day, but I just uh, had a, a big milestone, I guess, on my channel has gone to a thousand subscribers, which, you know, I never thought would even be possible. Uh, you know, it's one of them things I just kind of was doing for fun and you can get out and meet some people. And it's funny because, I mean, when I started doing this here a couple years ago, I mean, I've had a channel, I watched people, you know, for years, but I never really put anything on and never really commented or anything. And there's a guy, his name's Dave, uh, Dave Kelly, a real nice guy. Uh, DLK Hay is his channel. Uh, he's out west, originally a Maritimer. And uh, he had a channel, I mean, a video on his channel, and I remember watching it, and it was basically him just talking about, you know, him him starting his channel, and you know, anybody out there, you know, get yourself out there, basically what he'd say, you know, make a video of yourself. So I'm saying the same thing, get yourselves out there, you know, make a video, put it up. I mean, we're all in the same boat, we're all trying this, we're all farming, you know, just kind of a good thing, get out, and meet people, and I never forgot it, you know, I seen that video, and that's when I started. So really, Dave was my first subscriber, I remember. And that's how I met him. I commented on him, and then we scribed, and then I got learning. He was from here too, back east. You know, he's he's a ways away from me, but and, and then you know, yes, we into that. And then I met Mac Farms. He's he's from here. Of course, I always watch the bigger channels too, right? And uh, but I always kind of like the smaller channels because they're ones more I can relate to. You know, I don't have 300 horsepower tractors. You know, uh, I got old gear. You know, just kind of like seeing how other guys do more for the ideas. You know, I watch a lot of YouTube for different ideas. So that's how I met a lot of guys. So I think, and then they got Mac Farms. He's down in Cape Breton. He's actually was uh, closer to Dave than I'd be, and uh, so he was another one early, very early to get into. And then of course him and I are just you know, almost like brothers now. We talk every day, and uh, same day. I mean, Dave and I will message back and forth and stuff. And and, uh, and there's Brad from North Wisconsin Farming. I mean, same thing. Great guy. Met him early, early on. And then, of course you met other people through, right? But I, you always remember the first ones when you kind of started into it. You know, they kind of kind of, I guess build your self esteem. They comment on some stuff. I don't get a lot of comments. Uh, I didn't do it for, you know, to get subs or any of that stuff. I did it more or less for my family and kids. So my kids could kind of grow up and they get to see what, you know, what I did. You know, something could happen to me tomorrow and I'd be gone, right? And uh, not saying this is a thing kind of a legacy by any means, but they'd be able to look back on the computer and kind of see some of the things I've done. And it is neat when you look back through your channel and you say, well, two years ago, look at this, this is where I was at. And this was sitting here, right? And well, if you know my yard, most stuff's still sitting where it was. <laughs> I am a collector. But, uh, you know, it's kind of neat when you look back through and say, my kids, they love it. They get in it. And, I mean, now they're at the age, Tim's five, and Brianna's eight. So, I mean, she's she likes coming in through the videos. And I like to get it so that, you know, we can get into some fancy cameras. Maybe they can film some stuff. But, hey, I just do it for fun. It's just something to do. It is kind of neat when you actually see people that, you know, take an interest in what you're doing. And, uh, you know... Yeah, yeah, it's a uh, thousand subscriber. I never would have thought there'd be a hundred people, right? You know, and, and uh, I had a couple of videos, you know, people show, took some interest in, and uh, you know, what kind of 
kind of blew up a little bit, but which is nice, you know. They say I just uh, just keep kind of doing the same thing I'm doing, and uh, you know, kind of go from there. But there are some big things coming. I can't wait, kind of. You know, I keep I, I like to talk, so it's hard for me to bite my tongue just to say, you know, not to say what I'm going to be doing. But uh, uh, there's a few guys that know me that do, you know, they already know what's going on. But it's uh, it's pretty exciting, a big step for us here on the farm, and uh, you know. It, it, I'm hoping that things will happen there and get some you know better stuff up on the channel and uh, but you know basically we're farming right so you get the same a lot of the same stuff so but pretty soon we'll be starting to hit the ground I'd be kind of I'm kind of interested in the squash deal you know it's kind of neat to see uh, how we're gonna do it you know like I told the guy I got lots of straw seed uh, lots of manure and a tractor lying away of water and or an acre of ground right so, you know, he's pretty excited. He, like I say, he's, he's a good guy. He's got a pretty good green thumb. So he's a good guy to kind of bring on board, right? So, anyway, I wish we could have been outside. Uh, you know, shot a little video outside. Uh, a little bit windy for it today. So we're just, uh, thought we'd sit in the old Dodge here, listen to come and rumble, rumble. And if you don't want to listen to me, you can hear that running. But they, uh, and, uh, you know, pretty soon, though, I mean, it's been pretty decent. We're trying to get some yard work done. And, I had so many things on my plate here lately that I haven't uh, haven't really been too focused on making videos, but they'll be coming. Things will be coming here pretty steady, you know. But uh, anyways, again, I do appreciate everybody's support. I mean, a thousand subscribers—that's a pretty big milestone. I never would have thought that would ever happen. So, you know, thanks to everybody out there, you know. And uh, if you get a chance, check out some of them guys' channels. There's a lot of channels, believe me, man, that I you know that I watch. And uh, but like I say, there's always the ones that kind of stick out in your head that when you started out. And I def Dave was definitely one of them. Hey, hey, I never forget that video. And if you look back far enough, you'd find it exactly what I'm talking about. And uh, if you get a chance, check out some of them guys. Uh, you know, all great guys, great channels. And uh, we'll see you guys in the future. Then, thanks.